My God, I'm loving this. I'm loving it. And tonight's Corner Office, a new way to sell wines with in-home tasting parties. Boisset Wine. Living at Home is a relatively new social marketing program developed by the Boisset Family Estates. Ambassadors for the company arrange parties and educate attendees about Boisset wines made in California. In the past few years, the division has grown from eight to a few hundred Ambassadors, I might become one. Here to tell you more is the owner, Jean-Charles Boisset. Welcome, Jean-Charles. Bonsoir. Bonsoir, yeah. mon ami, or garçon. And I've got to tell you, I hate a man who comes dressed better than me. What's wrong you with you? You look very charming as well, and I love your pochette. That brings you the wine oh, style shit. to life. Oh, there we go. Well, we've got to have a sip. Okay, what do we have here? What, what are we drinking? All ambassadors always start the tasting with... JCB number 69, which is a burgundy sparkling wine, very high end, 18 months, age in the bottle, which delicately caresses your palate and bring celebration to your mouth and to your friends. Now, Jean Charles, one of my producers says, hold the stem, hold the stem. I'm holding whatever I want to hold. Well, and it's called number JCB 69. So mm. you go and figure it provides pleasure to anybody who touches it. Okay, we want to quickly go through the wines because we want to get to the business and the, and the economics of this whole thing. What do we have next? Afterwards, you're going to try yes. a Chardonnay from Raymond Vineyards in the heart of Napa. Right. And then we're going to try another red wine. But what is very exciting is this new opportunity provides ambassadors, mm. people who have five hours a week, ten hours a week, very flexible schedule to be able mm -hmm. to start their own wine business mm -hmm. and bring the tasting room to someone's home, their homes, to a bar, anywhere. So you're, you're, are you selling your, your, your wines, your product in stores as well? As well. So it's a different set of wine, which is actually selected for the Wine Living Program. Uh -huh. And it's the extension of the tasting room. So whatever mm. we have in our tasting room in Napa, Sonoma, Burgundy, you could bring it to life in someone else's living room. I tell you, I'm going to be like James Carwell. Boy, I'll tell you, this tastes good with pigs in a blanket. Mm. Mm. Perfect for Thanksgiving. Mm, to say the least. <laughs> My God. <laughs> and everything else. And what do we have here? What, what next? The next wine is the Sheriff. Yes. So this is one of the first winery ever in the wine world. First California winery founded in 1857 called Buena Vista Winery. Uh -huh. And the count who founded it was the first sheriff in Southern California. So we started a wine named the legendary badge, the sheriff. I bet you I could arrest a, arrest a ribeye and have a great <laughs> deal with this. Now, I Without understand. being arrested. <laughs> <laughs> now look, this is kind of lucrative for an ambassador. I, uh, uh, this is amazing. This is something I've always wanted to do in my life. Over the last 20 years, I finally did it a few years ago with mm -hmm. an amazing team of people. It allows everybody to get in the wine business with a few hundred dollars. They have their own website, own selection of wine. They go present wine, taste wine, have fun with friends. Mm -hmm. And they make 30 to 35% on every bottle of wine they sell. That is amazing. And then we have a wine club as well named the Boisset Wine Society, which if you sell $100,000 of wine, mm -hmm. you make $35,000 which is pretty significant when you think about it. Typically, what kind of person do you, do you, do you find for Well, an it's everybody who wants to have a flexible schedule, their own business, who is very social, who has a lot of friends, who is at home or not at home, and people who enjoy food, people who enjoy art, people who enjoy, you know, interactions. But see, here's my thing, though. I mean, it sounds great, and I know it is, but see, if everybody looked like you, see, I could bring you over to my well, neighborhood. Well, Julian, you are an ambassador. Are you, you signing know, in? Oh, I, I might as well. Yes! You see what I have to do, though? You know, I have to, you know, I have to open up my shirt. I have to show the hairs on my chest. Well, you have much you know, better I mean, I love this. I, do. I don't know about I that. Look at that smile and that speech. Yeah, I, yeah, I, need to learn I, I don't from have you. to quaff, though. <laughs> Jean Charles. Well, which is exciting, though, it's accessible to everybody. So mm -hmm. it's 75% to 80% women. They had kids, they want to go back into the workplace, but on a flexible way. Or some people who are in transition, or some people who love just mm -hmm. entertaining, who loves to cook, who loves to receive. And the beauty of it, what I love about it, is the wine world is accessible to everyone. Well, I'll tell you, this sounds like a really great concept. I like this. I like to cook. I like to receive. And, and you like to drink wine. I like to drink. Jean <laughs> Thank Santé, you so much. Mon ami. Santé. Welcome. Garçon. Well, folks, tomorrow on the Rise Exchange, the Chinese e-commerce giant Alibaba kicks off the world's biggest online shopping day of the year, celebrating the single life. Now for a little look at how the markets did today. The Dow closing up at 17,613. The S&P 500 closing up to 2038. And the Nasdaq end of the day also closing up to 4651. I'm Julian Phillips along with Jean-Charles. In for Andrew Smirtsy Smirts. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. <laughs>